I think we should take a drug test prior to the debate. I do. I think we should. Why don't we do that? I don't know what's going on with her. But at the beginning of her last debate, she was all pumped up at the beginning. And at the end, it was like, oh, take me down. She could barely reach her car. So I think we should take a drug test. So, I'm, anyway, so I'm willing to do it. That, that from uh, Trump in New Hampshire yesterday, and that uh, something is, quote, going on with her. Uh, Bruce Lavelle is executive director of the National Diversity Coalition for Trump, and he's my guest out of Atlanta. Sir, how you doing? And welcome back here thanks. to America's yeah. Newsroom. Thanks for making time on a Sunday. Well, what is that all yeah, about? Yeah, thanks for having me. Take a drug test. Well, well, I think it's I think it's a fair uh, question. You know, uh, Ms. Clinton, unfortunately, and just for the record, uh, our prayers go out to her. You know, on her health, if there is something going on, first off. But most of all, she does have. Uh, you know, a history of being a little wobbly, uh, looking a little uh, confused in, in some of her interviews. So I, I think, you know, for example, I have business owners who own companies here, and to drive a, a forklift, you have to take a drug test to, that you won't injure anyone. So I, I think it's a fair question for so the American people, what, too. What, you, what in the world would you test her for? Well, I mean, you know, I, I don't know. I, I think, uh, you know, at the end of the day, that that will reveal itself to what could be going on. And, I, and once again, I think it is really fair to the American people to, you know, to vet part of the vetting process to see if the next commander in chief is of good sound mind and good health to lead this nation. Uh, I don't know if it's ever been done before. You're, you're, you're serious about this, right? Well, uh, you know, I, I, like I said, I think it's a fair uh, request. You know, for example, President Obama was a, a strong smoker. You know, the question is, him smoking cigarettes. Is there anything going? So I, th I think once again, it, it is a very valid question to to ask, especially if a candidate he or she has some record of, you know, looking, you know, a little wobbly or a little uh, unhealthy. So well, I, I, I think took it's his fair. I took his comment more rhetorical than anything else. Uh, that's that's the way I heard it.